Number four is live in Chula Vista this morning. Students are celebrating the sport of gymnastics. Heather, it's good to see you right side up. <laughs> I know, yeah. Seriously, letting the blood come back to my head. We're having a lot of fun this morning. I want to introduce you to some very awesome elementary school students. Who's ready to do some gymnastics this morning? Yeah! Well, guess what? It's time to tumble, so you guys don't have to wait any longer. Go ahead and get in line, and we're going to... Whoa! Yep, they're excited. So here at Olympic View Elementary School, we're having a good time because it has just been proclaimed National Gymnastics Day in San Diego County. Kristen, who is the gymnastics director at the South Bay YMCA, is going to help us out and tell us a little bit about the setup. So it's like a mini gymnastics obstacle course for the kids, and this is a traveling course. Yes, this is the debut of our new mobile gymnastics program. We're going to be visiting 10 different elementaries in the community throughout the rest of this year uh, to bring gymnastics to the kids that might not have the opportunity to take our traditional gymnastics classes at the center. What are the different um, skills that they're learning and the coordination that these kids in elementary school age are getting to learn right here? You know, we're introducing them to, you know, basic bounding and jumping skills, to some balancing skills, to, you know, how to turn upside down. Um, so we're mixing in some fun as well so that they can have a good physical activity base for whatever activity they choose to pursue. And there's something else really cool happening in the south part of the county in November. November 2nd, a very large South Bay YMCA is going to be open and the opportunity for kids to get to go to gymnastics there is going to be available as well. Someone who is the very first charter member is here with us this morning, Bob Bobek. This morning, how you doing? I'm doing great. So Thank how you. important is this to you to have this huge South Bay YMCA opening, one of the largest facilities in this part of the county? The YMCA has been great. My kids went through it, the gymnastics, all the programs that they have, and uh, I'm just happy to be able to uh, support it. What's going to be your favorite part about that gym? I know people can get some exercise while they're in there as well. You know, it's kind of uh, everything. The, I think the YMCA kind of gives you that family feel, and uh, it, it's just comfortable being in there. So they're going to have a great gymnastics f uh, facility, and uh, just like they have over at South Bay and other areas. So... Um, so looking forward to it opening. Yeah, very exciting. That happens November 2nd. All of this is also helping to combat childhood obesity, which is a big deal that the county is trying to do in uh, San Diego. So as you see the kids learning their balance, they're just learning how to get active. This is really fun. I know, Raul, your little girl is getting involved in gymnastics because what is it, around three to five years old that they start tumbling? Is she going, is she going upside down and backwards yet? Oh, yeah. They teach her all that stuff. And I just showed Erica Fox a video that I took last weekend where they put her on one of these trampolines, oh, but it was a good six feet off the ground. And, and, and they were supposed to take a dive into the uh, the little foam squares thing, the little, yeah. you know? Yeah. And I, there's no way, I told my wife, there's no way our girl's going to jump six feet off a thing into like a spongy. She went, boom. she went boom, boom, boom. boom. Then and then did it twice. again. And then did it again. Again, Heather Ford, she, she did it twice. She loves it. And they do the balance beam. Well, and, and all that. That's the thing is when you start them out young, they don't have the fear. Us, you know, you start us out in our 20s and our 30s, and we're not going backwards. That's right. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> Absolutely. <happening. laughs> I'm going to shout out, shout out Mr. Eric. Mr. Okay. Eric was cracking down on that gymnastics class for us last weekend. Is that the right? The kids were misbehaving. The three-year-olds were not listening, not paying attention. Mr. Eric said, hey. Hey. I am Mr. Eric. You don't mess with me. I'm teaching you gymnastics. And I'm Mr. Eric. And did they listen? They did. They did. They, gotta, they have to go to mommy and sit out for one routine. Oh. And then they come back. That's punishment right Says, there. Do you know why I took you out of that routine? Your little girl didn't do that, though. No, she it wasn't listened. my little girl. My little girl was not one of the <laughs> she listened. ones that got to like a... But it was something else. I mean, she literally went boom, boom. You saw it. Boom. And it was like... Ew. Like little buddy foo-foo, mm -hmm. just right in there. Into oh, the pit. There's a lot of people visiting us. Producer Ortlip is here. We've got an audience, live studio audience this morning. <laughs> Commuter Carl 1.0 is here. <laughs> uh, DJ 